Hello everyone, Super Action is back here again on today's episode. We're taking a look at the first official trailer for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mutants in Manhattan. Now, for those who don't know, this is this has been leaked for a while, so you probably do know. But for those who don't know, Mutants in Manhattan is a game being done by Platinum Studios. We know now, more about this, so he'll explain it. I'm explaining, yes. Uh, now, for those who don't know, Platinum Studios is best known for... Um, it's made up of former... Um, Heads from former people from like Capcom, Clover Studios. Yeah. So guys who did like Okami, Beautiful Joe, games like that. Didn't they do also the the most recent um, Transformers? I'm again. I'm talking about the former. Oh, and I'm what sorry. they do now. I'm sorry, I'm getting this. And ahead now of us. what they do is games like Mad World, ba the Bayonetta games. Uh, uh, was it the Legend of, that Legend of Korra game that came out? And the one you just mentioned, which was the Transformers. Um, and they just I recently the did was. Transformers Devastation. Now, they are greatly known for doing some solid hack and slash uh, action titles. So, if you ever get a chance, check out their previous stuff. But this has been the worst kept secret ever. Like, there's been leaked achievement lists, there's been leaked f images. I mean, now we're getting official announcement trailer and stuff. And from what I've heard, it sounds really good. So, let's get to it. Let's check a look at this uh, announcement trailer. So, and here we go. Rated T for Teen. I have to see if I live. Patience is the greatest virtue of a conqueror. Yeah. For years <laughs> we've been hiding in the shadows. Observing the city and biding our time. When dawn yeah. breaks it's, tomorrow, it's like the city will awaken to new rulers. Tonight, the Foot Clan emerges. Tonight, the war begins. Ooh, okay. That is a very interesting version of Shredder yeah. mm. Yeah. Sure. This is bad, guys. Really, really bad. Cool. Oh, wow. Oh. Okay, that's awesome. War, we'll give him a war. I like the I like the look. Holy crap! Well, well, talk about a stupid fish out of water. Awesome. Oh. Oh. Damn. Some shows. Wow. wow! Holy crap! crap. That looks wow. gorgeous. I, I hate to say it, I'm excited for that a little bit more than the sequel movie. I will say, I me too. This is a game that I I definitely want to mind buying myself. Yes, like I said, it's Platinum Games. It's just amazing. If you've ever seen their work or played their other work, you know well, I've seen their they work. are good at their craft. Like the one only game I know that got mixed. For their so the list of their titles was Anarchy Reigns. That got mixed titles. But for now, that looks great. Now, what I was saying before is it has a cell shader style. And they've done a cell shader style before. Have you seen that Yeah, one? yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you it. saw it. It was a black and white style. It was a black this and one, white. This one, it's colored. Yeah. And oh my god. It, it just, gives it that it's comic just, feel it's look. Just, it's just like Transformers Devastation. What may it work with, not only did they go back to the traditional G1 Transformers. Yeah, exactly. But the way they, the art style they did with it was magnificent. It, was and it, it, it made you feel like you were watching an old episode of the series. This is what this show feels like. Kind of. Kind this of. show feels more like you're playing one of the original comic books. That's what it looks like, and, and this it style looks, looks gorgeous. It looks amazing. The gameplay it looks, looks amazing. I, the I, gameplay I, looks tight as hell. Now I know from what I heard, the only downside this game is it will not feature four-player split screen. No, it which won't. is not, but it will feature co-op through online means. But color, color me convinced. This looks amazing. It looks amazing. I can't I wait can, to. See, I can't I wait to see more gameplay. But just the just the look, even the. The voice actors you can hear like are freaking awesome. Are, are they nail the voice actors? They too. nail it just right. Shredder though, for a second, Shredder's mask because you know what cell shade design? It's like those black marks. Yeah, yeah. Shredder's design, those black marks kind of look like a gigantic cat mustache. Yeah, exactly. I'm like, why does he have a giant cat mustache? Cat stash. A cat, you know, giant cast, cat stash and stuff. But that's besides the point. This is a game that's this, definitely on my list to play. This it's, looks so amazing. I can't wait to see more. 
Oh uh, man, this looks great. I can't wait to see more more action, more gameplay like, for this. Like they they didn't do so well with Legend of Korra. No, they didn't like, so well. But they 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 after after Korra when they did Transformers, it looks like they found their craft with licensed titles. Yeah, that's what it was. I mean, like I said, like I said Korra got mixed, but people generally still enjoyed it once yeah. you got the combat down pat. Yeah, exactly. But this looks solid. This looks like it's going to be amazing. This will be their next big license title. I think this is going to be a, a big kick up for them. This is show, hey, this, this is what we can do. This is what you know. This is what we're capable of. You know, besides, like I said, really kind of what kind of really kicked them off a little bit is like what I said. Um, besides the other games, but Transformers. That's what really that was one of to me. It feels like that's one of the games that really kicked it exactly. in. Exactly. And after that, that's when it's like, okay, you so see, they kind of hit the mark with Korra. They hit it with. Devastation. Looks like they're going to head out of the park with this one. With this one. So I can't wait. Because if they do great with this one, imagine what other licensed styles they can get their hands oh, on. Whatever they can get their hands on. If any type of 90s style type of uh, 90s no. game. Oh, no, overall, to me. X, X, X Men 4 player co op in Cell Shades. That was oh. so tight. Oh, if yes. they did it. If they was, did the X Men. No, and not oh. just any X Men. 92 X Men. Because oh, yes. remember, they are doing a rebooted series. Based around the '92 version. Oh of the X -Men. yes, yes. Um, so that would be perfect if they could do that. That's oh wow, that would be awesome. But other than that, this looks amazing. We can't wait. Oh so yes. So if you're new to the channel, you can like, comment, share, subscribe. What's our last video? Who knows if it's exciting as this one? But bam, just click right here, check it out, see what we've been up to lately. But for now, I'm Fox. I'm Bruce. And that's been another cowabunga size episode of SRB. See ya later.